I'm going to show you how I diffuse my hair while minimizing frizz and reducing dry time by 90%. Here's what you'll need. Today, I use Not Your Mother's Pearl Tox Sculpting Gel because this is a firm hold. Reason why you want to use a firm hold gel like this is because all that air is going to be blowing and it's going to get frizzy, so you want to have something that holds it all together. Next, you're going to need a blow dryer with this diffuser attachment. When you turn it on, turn it to the very, very lowest heat setting. Using that low air and heat setting, you're gonna hover all over your head like this. Keep a little distance from your hair because if you blow close, it'll cause frizz. Also, your arms are gonna get really tired, but it's a great arm workout and your hair will thank you. Do this until your hair is about 90% dry. Once you do that, look at your blow dryer setting because there's going to be like this blue button right here that pushes out cold air. You're gonna use the same heat setting as before to cup your hair up like this. Hold for about 30 seconds and then use that cold air to lock in the style. If your roots are still wet, dry it like this and lift it up so you can keep the volume. Do the same to get the inner parts of your hair and just hover for those. Now that my hair is cooled down, I'm just going to take um, this hair oil. Use whatever hair oil you have. Do a couple of drops on my hand and then... Put the oil on the ends of your hair first because that part is usually the driest and then move upwards. This help breaks up the gel cast. Remember, scrunch and hold. You don't want to do a lot of movements because if you're doing too much, it's going to cause a lot of frizz. After you do that, you can now separate the clumps. This just helps your hair look fuller and more voluminous. This is what my hair looks like, diffused, and it only took me 10 minutes. Let me know if you guys have any other questions and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!